There you go. Old jumpy. Goodness, he didn't look that big. He taking that much drag. Well, she's light because she's real lightweight. Nice little bass. Probably not even a keeper. You think he's 14? Uh, close. Yeah. Maybe close. Boat flip. Boat flips only. Nah, that's a 12 incher. Ain't bad. First fish of the day. Pretty beat up. <laughs> there we go. We got a little battle scars on him. But we'll take him. First fish of the day. Gets the skunk out of the boat. Yeah, he tossed him in. There we go. Nose dive. Goose Creek Reservoir for some uh, redemption because I mean we were slaying them at Lake Murray we caught a caught two bass and one bluegill yeah a little bluegill decided to hit a worm that I was fishing with and poor little guy got hooked in the side of the face but anyway we're at the Goose Creek Reservoir it's a known good hopefully we get something because I mean if not our wives are gonna give us hell when we get home but we'll, we'll see how that goes. Anyway, I'll turn this back on in about 25, 30 minutes. All right, here we are. Goose, Goose Creek Reservoir, round two. Going old school. Yeah. Gotta do a little redemption down here. This, this is a known good. This is in the backyard, pretty much. Lake Murray was not nice to us. Two hour drive, not a whole lot of fish wanted to play. Yeah. Now we're back in the water. It looks like a irritated bowel in a toilet bowl not so clear as it was up there in columbia but uh well let's see if we can pull out here maybe we'll get some videos of fish um well y'all have a good one First cast. There we go. First cast. Look at that. Oh, that's oh, nice. Oh man. Oh yeah. Oh, don't let him jump too much. We got enough. We got enough. Let it keep him in the water. Keep him down. Keep him down. Keep your head down, buddy. Work way over here. Oh, there we go. There we. There you go. Got him. First cast. I'd say that's a little bit of a redemption. Yeah, man. All right, let me grab that lip. I think the crankbait's stuck in the net. Here. Barely got him. Just barely got him. You want to add him to your neighborhood pond? Yeah. All right, let's get that <laughs> live well going. Yeah, it's got water in it. All right. Anyway, here we go. <laughs> First cast out here at the old reservoir. I'm going to take this one out into the oh. neighborhood. He's probably three, three and a half, somewhere around in there. Solid fish for sure. Water kept on 
was not a thing. Yeah. That fish just wanted to be caught. He was like, he knew it'd be cooler out of the water. I think he's not, I mean, he doesn't feel very big, but you never know these ones until you get him up to the boat. That was a weird feeling. Oh, he's a, it's a yellow bass. Nice. Oh, yellow bass. You want to have in your neighborhood pond? No. <laughs> not this little guy. He'll, he'll Boy, eat that poor guy got hooked. <laughs> he'll eat every minnow we got in there. Did he catch all three hooks in the mouth? Uh, he had two. But he's free, and he's free. See ya, buddy. Thanks for playing. He put a hurting on that old plug. Well, he, he grabbed There we go. There you go, Jeremy. Get that camera there. There you go. He's still all right. Oh, yeah. There we go, Jeremy. There you go. There we go. What we got? I don't know. Let's see. Let's, Let's get my old. Oh. Let's flip. Another yellow bass. There we go. Boy, this poor guy. He got it bad. Yeah, he did. Yeah, let's get us out and get him back in the water. Face and a side full of troubles. Yeah. All right. So a pair of pliers here in the console if you need them. Pull that one out of the side, the one I was worried about sticking me. There we go. Oh, yellow bass. Here you go. Oh, you probably put it. There we go. You can tilt the back if you need to. Got Jeremy wearing him out. <laughs> so I just got a little dorsal, dorsal <laughs> fin in my finger. Find us some more of those three pound bass, Jeremy. Way, way lay into you. about a six out here in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> so we've been fishing for 10 minutes and we are caught more than we caught there in Murray. Murray's a big, big lake and a whole new animal. Yeah. Water deep sucks. water, 144 feet deep today. I mean, that water looks like you could drink it. Yeah. Super clear. Yeah, we went from fishing 20 feet down to about four and a half right now. Another white bass or yellow bass. That old came over there and just dunked it a couple oh, of times. There you go. I, I just had two thumps. Why those? Those yellow bass, man. They look like freaking big perch. Yeah. There we go. There we go. That's a real bass. No. It's uh, another yellow bass. If that was a real bass, he has a pretty dark back there. These guys are really good at hooking themselves. I don't think I've caught. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and get him down before I catch a hook in my finger. He got all, all three hooks. Freaking 
missile out of my hand. All right, got another one on. Fighting, fighting the old yellow bass. Yeah, not so much a bend, but let's see, let's see what comes out. Old yellow. Boat flips only. <laughs> that was a terrible boat flip. Boy, they really, they really like hooking themselves, don't they? <laughs> and unhooking themselves. All right. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, add himself back to the lake. Got about a hundred of these guys. Whoop. Whoop. All right, well, <laughs> he's going he's going back to the drink. Eventually, we'll get him in the water. There you go. Yeah. He's got a lot of fight. I'm just tearing these little guys up. Poor little fella. So we could get some that look like a crappie. I'd be okay with that, or a largemouth. But, yeah. The hard part is getting the hook out without hooking your hand. Yeah, they, they move a lot. Hooking your hand. All right, another one we're going to send back to the to the drink. Oh, guy. See ya. On a largey. You got the net? Yeah, let me, let me grab it. Uh, I, think, I think it's a largemouth. It's a significantly larger than... See what's gonna, what's gonna show its head. There you go. There you go. Work him, work him in that net. There we go. <laughs> Largey. That's a nice one. A couple pounds. <laughs> yeah. We'll give it there, we go. there we go. I was like, man, we gotta be getting close. We just passed that waypoint. I was like, I'm surprised we haven't hit another largemouth out here. We got one. So you have a hundred pairs of pliers on the boat. So you can always have a pair within reach. There you go. That old large is 12 inches. We'll go to the farm pond for the kids to catch. Old neighborhood pond. There you go, buddy. Actually, yeah. we won't crowd that guy. We'll throw him in here. We won't get him back for it. Or took it out of the other one's mouth. Fish fighting. <laughs> That's a decent size one. That's one of the bigger ones. Are these suckers. Yeah. I'm not messing with anybody. Yeah. Oh, I'm sure y'all, y'all out there that know what these are, know how fun they are not to take hooks out of their mouths. He gone. Another one, Jeremy, in this beautiful sunset here. Shame bringing the paint on these little guys. There we go. Get a little, little fight out of it. Look at that. And another one. There we go. That's hey, look how at that. I can release those. Get on him. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> They're at that. Got another one. They are at that distance, man. POV. They are at that distance. Oh. oh that's a boat. Oh. Open it. We get, feel like a bass? It's heavy. All right. Heavier than normal. Let me go grab that net real quick then. Yep. There nope. we go. He's a nope. big, big yellow bass. Yeah. No matter. Big oh. yellow bass. Look at them. They're getting better. <laughs> Taking that hook out. He's on. Jeremy's on. What we got here? Mono ride to the Ooh. I'll throw those. I'll bring you in. Dang, he's seen some things. Look at that. That one's a little beat up. Watch those hooks. I'll just grab them with the pliers, man. They're right there behind you. Oh, yellow bass. Oh, he got himself down to one hook. It's kind of pro. There we go. He's gone. We got it now, Jeremy. I mean, he. Yeah, he's taking drag. Clobbered it. Oh, no, he's just a it's big. A big one. yellow bass. Yeah, yeah. That is a that's a stud right there. That might be the biggest of the day. So uh, that is about as big as they come. Yeah. No, he ain't flopping as much as a little one. Well, he is. 
Now he is. So, I, don't, I don't feel like going to the, the piercing pagoda with these guys. You don't you don't need a new finger piercing? Shit, no. Six cents uh, finger piercing? <laughs> yeah, there he goes. Good job, big one of the day right there. Yeah. Head back to the dock now. We uh, tore up the little bat uh, little perch or yellow bass or I'm not I'm gonna have to Google that. Um, just to make sure, but little shits were fun. We got a couple in the live well, big old bluegill. Um, and we didn't didn't get it on camera because he hit next to the boat, but big big one. We'll have to take a look in there. Hand sized bluegill on a crankbait. Yeah, they're uh, we're moving them to a little more tame pond back there behind uh, Shane's house, so that we can catch them later just for fun. And, He's got kids in the neighborhood that like to fish it, so help him out a little bit. Alrighty, I'm gonna run back to the dock. Well, here we are, wrapping up our second trip of the day to the old Goose Creek Reservoir. So, Had to have some redemption. Yeah, we got some fish in the live well. Caught plenty of fish. Uh, on the on the, the water out here i mean i think we caught first 10 minutes we caught what we caught at uh everything we caught in murray so it was it was pretty amusing and i mean i think some of those little other fish we were catching were bigger than the bass we caught at murray so that's a that's a that win a solid 13 inch or a solid 13 inch <laughs> yeah so you weighed all a point 90 so you too can be successful wake up Freaking six in the morning, driving to one lake and not catching crap, and then going to your little honey hole that you know of, uh, which ours are here at the old Goose Creek Reservoir. But anyway, yeah, I appreciate y'all uh, taking a view with the video. If if we're anything, it's uh, not refined and not professional. So hopefully you enjoy the the content because again, we're fairly new to this, so we're just trying to have fun. Y'all take care. Yeah. <laughs>